WOWT 6 News in depth. It is a rite of passage for so many summer camps. Some make lifetime friends as they forge their independence in the wild. In a story you'll only see on 6, Brian Mastery reports in depth on a camp where the adventure continues well past high school. Summer camp disappointment often follows the hard rain. On this morning, wet conditions canceled any outdoor activities at Camp Eagle in Cedar Bluffs, Nebraska. Bon. Hello. Bon but that didn't seem to matter to the campers. Show us how you bungalow. <laughs> his hands are high, his feet are low, and this is how he bungalows. Maybe it helps that there's no lack of attention here. The staff to camper ratio is one to one, and they're energized. This place is about relationships, not a busy camp schedule. Like many camps, the mixture of personalities and abilities vary. Second verse. Cindy took a week-long break from babysitting to be here. This is how he bungalows. Zach loves everyone when he isn't being shy. Larry doesn't speak. This is his 28th summer. Yet, he's understood. People here are really caring and take care of you really well. Cindy Hemberger of Hastings has been to this Easter Seals camp so many times, she could qualify as a counselor now. You've been coming to camp how long? I've been coming since I was six years old and I've just turned 40. How was it? It was fun. She still remembers why she came in the first place. Because it was a new adventure to be with kids who are like me. The young and older campers mix, even learning from each other. You don't normally think of people with special needs going to camp. It's a safe place. No one is different under this roof. And they just gain a lot of independence, so um, you just see it like come out in them, in the campers, they just get really excited and they lighten up um, when they get to do something they didn't think they could do, or just being able to be alone, away from their families with other peers is really cool. Lunchtime now, that'll be followed by two hours of, I love this, nap time and a very special evening planned on this last day of camp. The dance tonight. Do you like the dance? Oh, I love the dance. What they, about it? They get you all dressed up and do your hair and your makeup and put on fancy clothes. Even after 34 years of camping, the dance doesn't get old for Cindy or Larry of Lincoln. You love the dance. Do you think that would be your favorite part of camp? Yeah, the dance. It's a night where the campers and counselors take each other's hand, and the mind races for the romantics in the bunch, like Zach Kriz. Do you have a ring? No, not yet. He's got time. He's thinking of a marriage proposal three years from now. The tissue paper flowers will hold the ring one day. I want to keep her forever. But that's how summer camps work, where nature lets our mind wander. In Cedar Bluffs, Nebraska, I'm Brian Master reporting, WWT6 News. Easter Seals has a number of camps remaining this summer, and they do have openings. We've included the details on our Find It page at WOWT.com. 34 years ago in a camp. That's wonderful. I love that story. Yeah. Makes everyone smile tonight.